guys welcome to my channel happy new year it's my first video in 2017 a happy new 2017 or happy 2017 i hope you guys had a wonderful festive season i hope you guys enjoyed all the food hanging out with family i basically just hung out with my family and it was such a lovely time together and um, you don't really get to do that very often so that was very nice to have i wanted to thank you guys actually the guys who watched my previous video I wanted to say thank you guys to those who watched even though that video came with its challenges first of all it took me a while to edit it and um, it was actually uh, shot by my brother my brother is a photographer and I will leave his links and stuff and his social media platforms here somewhere on the screen I will leave it all in the description box below so definitely check that out so my brother helped me to film that I basically told him the vision that I wanted for the video and I just told him you know this is what I want to do let's do it and he was he was definitely into it and he filmed it I edited it but the bit where I had a little bit of issue was finding music for it so a song I used was with Azealia Banks and Pharrell the song I didn't realize at the time had restrictions in it even though I knew I can't you know um, monetize that video I didn't realize that it came with additional restrictions so basically the video can't be watched on mobile devices any kind of mobile device so like a phone or a tablet or any sort of mobile device it couldn't be shown on there but you can watch it on you can watch it on a laptop or I think you can watch it on TV. I'm not very sure on that, but I know you can definitely watch it on a laptop. If you just copy the link and paste it on your laptop or just go on my channel and watch it on your laptop, you'll be able to watch the video. So I'm so sorry and I apologize to those who thought the video was not existing. The video does exist. The video is watchable, but you have to watch it on a laptop. I really put a lot of work into that video. It took me so long to edit it and I really just wanted it to pay off, but it just wasn't working out. Anyway, I just put it out anyways. And I thank the guys that enjoyed it and the guys that commented and liked the video. Thank you guys so much for all the support and thank you for watching it. So today's video is going to be something different. I'm trying out some Primark lip products. I went into Primark like a while ago. They have like beautiful lipsticks, liquid lipsticks, lip pencils for an affordable price. I, I like liquid lipsticks but sometimes I can find them a bit too drying or they're not quite right. So the only ones I had at the moment that I didn't have any issue with or I didn't have any issues with were my NYX ones and I've been using that for a while so when I went into Primark and I saw these I thought I would give them a little bit of a try I first of all picked up two and some lip crayons to try them out and I really liked them so I went back to pick up some more and so I'm gonna be showing you guys the different shades I picked up so I have some lip pencils to show you, some lip crayons to show you, and also some liquid lipsticks. If you guys are interested to see this kind of video, I don't really do much makeup videos on my channel, but if you guys are um, interested to see this kind of video, definitely stay tuned and let's get into the video. Please do not mind my nails. Say what? I haven't had time to go and get them sorted out and I bite my nails, so um, yeah, my nails be very, very crusty. So please do not mind them just ignore them let's just act like they're done yeah <laughs> these are the lip pencils that i picked up i picked up one two three four five six seven eight lip pencils and all these lip pencils are all a pound each i'm going to be showing you guys this lip pencils on my lips so i have my lips all moisturized and i moisturize my lips with the eos lip balm i have really dry skin and i have really dry lips so this is the only moisturizer that actually <laughs> works for me. The first thing you want to do is definitely moisturize your lips before you put anything on your lips. I have some liquid lipsticks to show you. I picked up four liquid lipsticks and two lip crayons and they're all in, in like a neutral color. I'm really into like neutrals at the moment. I'm really liking it, even with clothes as well. So um, how am I gonna do this? So I'm gonna start off first with the brown. My only problem with Primark lipsticks and lip pencils and things it's so hard to take off the packaging. Like I, I have to use my tweezers to take these off because this is just ridiculous to me. Like why is it so hard to take off? Wow we made it. <laughs> it's like a pinky brownie color. <gasps> it's so smudged. <laughs> I guess this is the reason why it's about. Look at that. It's it's like oh my god. 
I think Primark really needs to sort out their like packaging. Seriously, first of all, it's too hard to open. Second of all, this like it's all squashed in there. Look. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna sharpen it. It's actually very nice on its own, the lip pencil. It's very pretty. It's very nice. Like that's actually quite nice on its own. The liquid lipstick I'm going to be using here is called Carla and it's like a brown color. I can't believe it now. What's the story? Oh my god. That is such a lovely brown. Like it's really nice. It's such a gorgeous brown. Every time I apply it, it's like I fall in love with it all over again. It dries your lips just a little bit. I have a lip gloss that I use and I just put that in on my lips and that kind of gives it a little bit of moisture which I know defeats the whole purpose of having a liquid lipstick that's drying and lasting but it still lasts the whole day because the moisture from the lip gloss kind of soaks into the lipstick and it's kind of matte but not drying. I don't know if that makes sense but it makes sense to me. I just want you guys to go with me. You can try it. It's not for everyone. Not everyone likes lip gloss on the liquid lipsticks, but I do. But I think this is pretty nice. It's pretty decent. I think it's such a you know beautiful lipstick, and they were only two pounds. The liquid lipsticks were two pounds, and the lip pencils were pounds. So for three pounds, you get yourself a beautiful liquid lipstick and a lip pencil. I mean, can you really go wrong with three pounds? If you guys want to know the names of these, I will leave like the names in order of how I filmed it, just so you know what is what. I I'll leave the names and the codes in the description box below so when you do go to the shop to try and find one you can just match it up with the codes because all of them i mean especially the um, lip pencils the uh names have come off already from you know they have like this silly little paper things that they literally just come off and so it's hard to tell what's what but they have codes on the ends of them so i would definitely leave the codes in the description box below so definitely check those out so i'm going to try the next color i'm just using um, regular baby wipes i only use baby wipes on my lips so let's see how it wipes off okay so the next ones i'm going to be using i'm going to be using these two lip pencils and one of them is called wine and it's like a dark um pink kind of looks a bit burgundy on camera but it's kind of like a dark pink and this is like a light pink so i'm gonna put this all over my lips put this on the outer corner and then put the liquid lipstick in the middle of my lips and this liquid lipstick is in the shade kendall yeah it looks like that i can't believe it now that's what the lip pencil looks like by itself this is that light pink one I think this is in the shade dark pink even though it's a lighter pink and that's what it looks like on my lips I'm gonna put in the liquid lipstick this is in shade Kendall like I said earlier oh look at that color right it's a beautiful shade and the formula is just really nice on the lips that is such a beautiful pink i'm just gonna wait for this to dry a little bit and then i'm gonna put this wine on the outer corner of the lips you have to do this while the lipstick is not completely dried because when it's dried it's quite hard to blend the lip pencil really nice i think i think this shade is a little bit drier than the last one i used because my lips feel really tight well not really tight but it's drier than the other one but what i'm gonna do is just put a little bit of lip balm on it so it's not like shiny but it would help with everything blending together and i'm just using my eos lip balm putting my finger in it and dabbing it on my lips just kind of helps to blend everything together really. you can definitely make this more vampy i've got three vampy shades this one's called hot gossip that's what it looks like let me take it out the packaging actually out this is called hot gossip 
that's what it looks like this shade is called aubergine and this is a much darker one and the last shade is called dark orchard i'm just gonna use this one i'm just gonna put this this is hot gossip oh this is much nicer that's hot gossip that i've just put around the corners of my lips to give it more depth because i thought that was a bit too light i think with lip products it's all about mixing and matching and just finding the shade that works for you at least that's what i do i put lipstick on top of lipstick lip liner on top of lip liner until i find the shade that i really like i think this is pretty decent i think it's pretty nice i'm gonna list all of these items in the description box below so check those out i will list them in order of how i have used them on my lips just so you can catch on to which ones i've used i like it a lot actually i think it's pretty nice so um now let's wipe this off and see if it comes off well just one pass I can definitely tell you guys that these last all day so you probably will need to reapply just depending on what you eat but I tend not to reapply because it lasts majority of the day it's not too hard to take off either so it doesn't like color your lips actually I lie it kind of tends to color your lips if you leave them on for you know throughout the day it kind of tends to color your lips like now my bottom lips, lips are the hill cut than before I started the video so the next combo I'm going to be using are these two right here. So I'm using this shade here, which is like a, um, this is like a dark pink again. It's actually like a burgundy shade. So I'm going to be using this shade with this liquid lipstick. And this is in shade Kylie. And I'm going to be mixing these two. So I'm going to use this first and put this over the top. So I'm going to apply the liquid lipstick, which looks like that that is a beautiful burgundy shade like oh my god oh i am in awe the applicator is a bit bent though yeah that's very bent Woo, that is beautiful what i've never worn this so i'm just like oh my god this is go this is gorgeous this is fantastic what? guys this is my favorite shade this is my favorite shade like i'm just i'm dying inside oh my god it's such a beautiful shade that's a really nice shade i really like that it feels really really nice on it's completely dry right now and it's not drying it just feels really comfortable it doesn't stick together it doesn't come off so i'm gonna take this off and try it on the next combo i think that had like shimmers in it because it's got there's like bits of shimmers on my lips i don't know if you can see it Okay, so for the last lip combo, I'm going to be using these two really dark shades, They're like really, really dark purple. So this is the shade Kiki and this is the shade Dark Orchard. So I'm going to be mixing these two and you know the drill. I'm going to use this on the lip and use this on top. Wow, that is very, very dark. <laughs> Just gonna go in with one more coat just to even out the whole thing. This definitely needs a bit more than the other ones to really cover the lips. This is definitely a lot for me. I think this is a bit much. I mean, it's really nice. It's not dry completely yet, but it's drying really nicely actually. I think it might need a little bit more lip line on the edges just to smoothen things out a bit more. This is uh this is some the words uh dull. This is definitely out of my comfort zone. This is a lot, but it's really nice. It's nice and dark. It's supposed to be like a dark purple, but on camera it's coming up a little bit black. And it's definitely comfortable as well. It's not too drying on the lips, so I think this would definitely last the whole day. Let's do a kiss test. Wow, this does not come off, guys. Look, nothing nothing comes off like just the 
little bit comes off there it doesn't come off on my hands it's not too drying i don't feel like it's gonna come off i definitely think you have to be you know like bold and ready to wear these like you gotta be ready you gotta be all right guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope you guys enjoyed my lip combos and i hope you guys liked it let me know which was your favorite lip combination in the comment section below do not hesitate to drop me a comment i really enjoy reading you guys comments they're so lovely and they're very encouraging and very constructive which i'm very very happy about so definitely you guys keep the comments coming up keep the comments coming i like them and definitely check out primark their makeup um section is growing like they are on their makeup game so you should definitely check um their makeup stuff out i'm actually wearing on my eyebrows their brow i think it's like a brow mascara that's what i have on my brows today mixed with my um, own pencil and yeah definitely check out their makeup stuff i don't think you'll be disappointed anyway they have nice brushes nice lipsticks lip pencils the beauty blender dupes they have everything so definitely check those out i hope you guys have enjoyed this video hope it wasn't too long i know it's something a little bit different because i don't really do um makeup -y sort of um content here on my channel but i'm trying to try something different out it's 2017 and why not so let me know if you guys like this kind of videos if you want to see more makeup videos drop me a comment as well in the comment section below and i will sure to do more for you guys if you're not already subscribed to my channel please click that subscribe button and there's this new annoying thing that youtube is now doing where there's like a bell somewhere on your screen and you need to click that bell so that you can get notifications from me when i post new videos now if you don't click on that bell you won't know when i have uploaded a video so you need to click on that bell and it notifies you whenever i upload a new video so definitely click, the, click that bell if you want to keep up with me it's kind of annoying but youtube does these things um thank you guys so much for all the support i've received here on this channel i love you guys so much thank you for all the good feedback thank you for all the comments for the liking the subscribing i'm just overwhelmed at this point but you know what i can't even complain thank you guys for your support follow me on my social media platforms i will leave those in the description box below as well definitely keep up with me on instagram if you're not already following me please run quick to instagram and click on follow why you're not following me yet why why anyways and thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video have a lovely 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 january i'll see you guys soon thanks